So this is the reception unit. This is where members and staff sign in. Uh, members are, uh, are referred to Fountain House from various agencies and psychiatrists. When people have a major mental illness, uh, they can come here. It's a voluntary program. People can come and go as they please. They can come at uh, 10 o'clock in the morning or at 8 o'clock in the morning, stay for an hour, stay for two hours, stay for 10 minutes. That's the voluntary nature of the program, which is very respectful of, uh, of people and their needs. And then we also have the work order day where there is work to be done uh, by members and staff to uh, help run the clubhouse. So this is the horticulture unit. Uh, we are uh, responsible for all the plants, uh, both inside and outside the clubhouse. We have uh, four gardens we take care of. In addition, uh, we grow flowers and other plants uh, up at the farm. We're arranging some flowers for a special event uh, this evening for one of the board members that are retiring. We do a couple special events every month. In addition, we have a rooftop garden uh, where we grow food for the salad bar. We have a hydroponics room back over here where we grow about 16 pounds of lettuce a week, also for the salad bar, uh, because uh, having access to organic, healthy food is not an option for many of our uh, members uh, due to the fact that it's quite expensive, especially here in Manhattan to receive that. Um, all the folks here work together. We design everything together. We grow the plants together. Uh, none of us are trained horticulturalists, uh, but we all kind of work together to produce, uh, you know, a, a, a thriving horticulture uh, experience here at Fountain House, providing both food and beauty uh, to the clubhouse. So this is the uh, culinary unit, and um, as you see, there are lots of people having lunch here, uh, eating, waiting to be served, and it's, a, uh, it's an exciting uh, hopping place. So uh, these are uh, computers that are available to the members to write their uh, college papers, do their, do their homework, and uh, also have uh, classes here on computers using them more efficiently. So this is the education unit and they help members get their high school diplomas, go on to college, uh, write their papers. They do basically standard stuff. They have a unique program where they have two college credit courses available here in the education unit uh, taught by members four members, which is rather unique, we, we feel. This is our jobs board. This is where members can come uh, to look for a paid job, which is rather unique to the clubhouse model. Uh, these are called transitional employment, also sometimes called supported employment. Like I said before, these are paid jobs that, uh, that people uh, with a mental illness are doing in order to, uh, uh, to move on with their lives uh, to bigger and better things. Here we have companies listed, and of course it continues over here. This is the, uh, the position in the company that's available. Here at Fox TV, it's loading dock, mail clerk, and shredding or shredding. Uh, the member, these are the members that are working at Fox at these positions. The placement managers are the Fountain House staff that uh, sort of help the members do their job at, at the companies. So this is a, a map of the world with all the clubhouses pretty much listed on, on the map. And there are about 300 clubhouses worldwide it's an international movement of uh, standards-based clubhouses. This is a warm and loving place. It's like a second home. It's like a family type thing. Uh, people generally love it. It's really great.